Hello and welcome to the New Indian Express news updates from Kerala. Finance Minister Thomas Isaac has reiterated his stand that the CAG report on Kerala Infrastructure Investment Fund Board was biased, saying it was part of a conspiracy to scuttle the state's development. He said the KFP issued masala bonds with permission from the RBI. The minister alleged that the CAG added four pages to the draft report which was not discussed with the state. The additional Chief Judicial Magistrate Court for Economic Offences in Kochi on Tuesday permitted the customs team probing the gold smuggling case to interrogate prime accused Sarit P.S. and Swapna Suresh. The customs will interrogate Sarit at VU Central Jail and Swapna at Ajakolangara Women's Prison in Tiruvanthapuram on Wednesday. The CPM has asked LDF independent candidate Karat Faisal, who was recently interrogated by the customs in connection with the Karipur gold smuggling case, to withdraw his candidature. The LDF had named him as candidate for the Chungapuram division of Koduvalli Municipality in Kodikod. The CPM intervened after Faisal's candidature triggered a controversy. However, Faisal has not accepted the party's demand so far. It is learned that he may contest as an independent. The Enforcement Directorate probing the money trail behind the Bangalore drug cartel case has summoned Vinish Kodiari's driver, Anikutin, for interrogation. He has been asked to appear for interrogation on Wednesday. A woman drowned as the car in which she was travelling fell into the lake near Cherai in Kochi on Monday night. 35-year-old Sabina of Karimalur in Ernakulam district's Paravur was returning with her husband after visiting Cherai Beach when the incident occurred. Salam, who was driving the car, managed to escape. The Kumli police have arrested a couple in connection with the murder of 55-year-old Sajeevan at Ottaga Talameda in Idiki district on Monday. According to the police, Balakrishnan and Shanti had invited Sajeevan to celebrate Deepavali on Sunday. He was killed in a drunken brawl. That's all for now. Please join us for the evening bulletin for the news updates. Thank you.